Hi, Jason here from Toman Synthesizers and welcome. Now, this year would have seen us hosting the second Toman Synth Reactor event. Uh, if you missed out on last year's, it really was a truly wonderful experience and an amazing event that really was the first of its kind. Seeing all those familiar faces together in one place over in Treppendorf, coming up with some crazy, crazy content. And if you missed out on that, we've got a playlist here which contains all of them. So go and check that out and see exactly what kind of crazy things happened if you didn't already know. So, unfortunately this year with the global pandemic and the state of travel in the world, it would have been irresponsible of us to try and host this event, but we wanted to keep the spirit of TSR very much alive. Collaboration, the family that was created out of that event. Instead, we reached out with the aim of, create, of, a, of having a giant collaborative music track. So each YouTuber invited would, uh, would add their own flavour into the pot and we'd build this track by track piece of music until we're left with, with what we've got now. This obviously is what you're going to hear in a minute. <laughs> Brace yourselves. So this is what they came up with. Hi everyone, hope you're all good. I'm Gaz Williams. I'm following on from the good doctor. Now he sent through a drum beat and it's a nice 120 BPM, quite simple beat. Uh, so I'm going to put a bass line to it. I won't go all the way through it. So if anyone else wants to contribute some chords and some riffs, they can, but I'll just do a section of it. Hey guys, I'm Hannah and I'm sitting here in Germany in my improvised home studio, which is actually my parents' office, which I took over. Um, but I added some keys and I got my laptop. So what I did is I got a bass part and a drum beat. So I added an arp in the verses. That kind of thing. And then I added some sort of synth to it. I put it all into Logic, then I did a bunch of production in it. So what I did is I took that synth part, put it into four different tracks and panned them all in different directions. So here, 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 and then chopped it up and bounced it all together again. And it sounds like this. So that's what I did. Um, I hope I didn't fill it out too much and you guys can have fun with it. Hello, Paolo Synthmania. Dr. Mix started the song with um, a beat from uh, the Roland TR-808. So I decided to follow suit with a keyboard of uh, about the same vintage, the Roland Jupiter 8. And this is what I'm gonna play. And I just think that uh, this typical sound of the Jupiter 8 fits well with the rest of the song.
Hello, it's Robin from Molten Music Technology. I'm going to throw in a little bit of modular, just a little bit, a little bit, mainly focused on the Basimilus Iteratus Alter from Noise Engineering, which is going to make this kind of noise. <laughs> Something a bit like that, really. Just something to add a bit of probability, a bit of noise, a bit of uh, rhythm and emphasis, perhaps. Oh, I don't know. I'm just going to muck about with this knob over here, right? And then with this knob over here, and hopefully that will sound all right. So I'm going to offer that up to whoever's doing the mixing to cut it in wherever you like or not. So it's going to go a bit like this. Hey everybody, I'm Rachel K. Collier. As you know, everything in the world has been cancelled the last couple of months, including TSR 2020. So what we've done is we've all bunched together and we've had a big old jam remotely and created this funky little track. And I've added some dreamy vocals. Slowly come up with a filter. Hey, it's Fabio from Noise London. So I've been given the job of mixing and arranging everything. First of all, I wanna say thank you to everyone for trusting me with your parts. I hope I do them justice. One of the biggest challenges was making sure that everyone had a chance to be heard because there's quite a few parts and there's a lot going on. But what I wanna do is take you through some of my favorite little edits that I made throughout the track to help with some of the transitions. So check this section out. <laughs> So what you can hear there is a little beat repeat and all I did was I took some of these sections, highlighted them with the marker tool and then did command R for repeat. And that just allowed me to create this kind of DJ beat repeat section, which acts as a nice fill. One of the other things I did was actually took these two parts here. So the kick and the snare, which originally sounded like this. And then I just reversed them by clicking over here. On top of that, to make this transition even more interesting, I added this sub drop and then a crash and a white noise impact. They sound like this. And all together, it sounds like this.
My other favorite section is what I would consider the breakdown or the middle eight before the last chorus. And I decided to apply some reverb and some filtering automation to that main synth mania Jupiter part. So the filter's opening up, revealing more high frequencies, and then I'm also automating that reverb, which is kind of making it a bit wishy-washy and allowing that last note to overhang over the next four beats. Here's what it sounds like in context. But you have to wait until the end of the video for the full reveal. Thanks again to everyone. It's a big love from Noise. Peace.